Not out of fix you. What? You done with me? Shall we? On your feet. Humpa, Muri Rava, Fupa, Jibampa Wula, Kabanotase, Makipuna, Malituta, Odmishka. Chikospa, Inigudad, Ijigliska, Chanaga. I'm Supreme Commander Rands of the Republic. It's an honor to speak with someone who's done so much to help the cause. Defeating the Void Wolf was a crushing blow to the Empire. You single-handedly turned the tide of the war. The Republic already owes you a debt it can never repay. But I'm calling because we need your help again. Wait, let me guess. Impossible odds, fate of the galaxy, death at every turn? I... more or less. Have you heard of Ilum? It's a remote, ice-covered world. It's also the galaxy's primary source of lightsaber crystals. The remnants of the Empire's forces have invaded Ilum en masse. We sent reinforcements, but they're getting overwhelmed. If this is the Empire's last gasp, I would have expected them to strike at a more populated world. Ilum's not your typical target. This is a raid, pure and simple. They're trying to strip the planet bare. The crystals on Ilum are unique, and the Empire has found a way to use them to amplify cloaking systems. With enough crystals, they could build an invisible armada, an entire fleet capable of striking any Republic world without warning. Give me a breakdown of the enemy forces. Darth Arho is leading the assault. He's hitting us with everything they've got. Elite military units, mercenaries, bounty hunters, and Sith Lords. Report to the Republic space station orbiting Ilum ASAP. A shuttle will take you down to the surface. We're using the Jedi Temple as a makeshift headquarters for our operations. Meet me there and I'll give you a full briefing. Rand's out. Chechopa, Kuma, Ni, Umpi, Butmalia, Bedwana, Nibobo.
Commander Rands is waiting for me at the Jedi Temple. I bet he's not. Darth Arho's troops have taken over the temple. Commander Rands and the others barely made it out alive. Had to set up their command post in an unsecured field. You need to speak to Commander Rands. I can take you there. Get on board and hold tight. It's gonna be a bumpy ride. Good, you're here. As you can see, we need all the help we can get. Let me introduce our allies. Master Bowden of the Jedi, and Commanders Karawar, Giandar, and Yetjub. <coughs> No, Karawar. The attack on the temple is to distract us from Darth Arho's true goal. Just as the peace talks blinded us before the sacking of Coruscant. I like you Republic folks, but it always seems like you're two steps behind the Empire with your plans. Which is why we can't fall prey to their tricks. The Imperials want Ilum's crystals. They're using deep miners to drill into the planet's core. The excavations leave massive sinkholes. The entire world's becoming unstable. If we don't stop them, Ilum could literally crack in two. Mem amgap kugap, kramanik, umka kiga mayamak. After you've cleared each mine, call us and we'll send reinforcements in to hold the area. Got it. Don't even need to write it down. Stopping the deep miners won't end this. Unless we locate the Imperial command post, they'll figure out another way to harvest Ilum's crystals. Good idea. After you disable each deep miner, download the mine's terminal data log. Bring all the data to Agent Sam Bradbur at the communications center for analysis. The fate of Ilum is in your hands. May the Force be with you.
I've secured the first excavation site and scanned the communications terminal. Well done. We'll send a team to secure the mine while you head to the next one.
on your feet. I'm at the last mine. Everything's all clear. Get that transmission data to Sam Bradbury. He's waiting for you at the Republic Communications Center. Agent Bradburn, I've got the data from all the mine terminals. I don't usually like working with civilians. Moran's was smart to put you on this. Let me contact him while this data is decrypting. Supreme Commander Rand's here. Master Bowden is with me too. Do we have the location of the Imperial Command Center? Just got the coordinates. Looks like the orders are coming from a small Imperial base on the ground. SIS scouted it before, but didn't think it was important enough to have priority. With the whole planet under siege, Arho knew Republic intelligence would overlook something so minor. I doubt Darth Arho's actually there. SIS reports you he likes to stay clear while someone else handles things on the front lines. He probably put his personal apprentice in charge. Lord Loyat is every bit as cruel and ruthless as her master. SIS has a file on her. Pretty go to the lightsaber. Killed at least a dozen other Sith during her time on Korriban. Never punished for it. Arho protected Loyette. Their relationship goes deeper than Master and Apprentice. If we capture Loyad, maybe we can use her as leverage against Darth Arho. Darth Arho is consumed by the dark side. He will cast her aside when she ceases to be useful. You can try to arrest her if you think that's best. But I won't miss her if she winds up dead. Once the base is out of commission, report back to Agent Bradbur. Good luck.
It's over, Lord Loyat. If it isn't the Republic's dirty little secret, the one the army and the Jedi turn to when they fail. But this is one mission you should have refused. You have no idea what torment you are about to suffer. I am Darth Arho's personal apprentice. Those who hear my master's name tremble in fear. I don't see your master anywhere. It's just you and me. You know nothing of my Darth Arho. He embodies all the Dark Council represents. His wrath is legendary. Master, hurry to my side. Together we will destroy these Republic fools. Darth Arho, can you hear me? It is I, Lord Loyat. Master, are you there? You really thought Loverboy was coming. Talk about a bad breakup. He wouldn't abandon me. This... this must be a test. Yes, a test of my strength. I will destroy you myself and prove to my master I am worthy to serve him. I yield! I yield!
The base is secure. I need a squad to take Lord Loyad into custody. But Darth Aho always claimed that Darkseid was stronger than the Light. He swore the Empire would always triumph over the Republic. He lied to me. He used me. And then he betrayed me. I am nothing but a fool. You have to pay for your crimes against the Republic. But if you cooperate, you'll be shown mercy. Thank you. Your words give me... comfort. Something I have not felt in a long, long time. Take her into custody. I need to get back. Agent Bradbury is waiting for me. Take whatever you can carry. Wipe everything else clean. Let's go! We're mobile in five minutes! What's going on? Our host troops just raided our command post. Massive casualties on both sides. Our boys drove them off, but the imps captured Supreme Commander Rands. Gian Dars ordered everyone back to the command post. I need to get back to the base. Grab your gear and head back. Gian and the others will want to speak with you. We'll be right behind you. If we storm the temple, Darth Aho might kill the Supreme Commander. We lost Commander Jubb in the attack, and can't afford to lose Rans too. Mem Amgap Kugap, Kramanik, Umka Kiga Mayamak. Sounds like another impossible mission for yours truly. <laughs> the temple with everything we've got. Arho won't stand a chance. No. The risk to Commander Renz is too great. We have to... Wait. What was that? Alam Giga Akapa. Greetings, Republic Commanders. My name is Darth Maldus. Time is short, so I will be blunt. I've been providing Supreme Commander Renz information to help him defeat Darth Arho. I'm here to offer you the same. Let me guess. Arho's one of your main rivals within the Empire, so you're using the Republic to eliminate him. More or less. The war is over. The Republic won. If we keep fighting, you will destroy us. I accept this. Darth Arho does not. He's a member of the Dark Council, but he's a thug. The Council needs someone more... progressive. If the Empire hopes to survive. Someone like you, I suppose. Openly opposing Aho would draw the wrath of the Dark Council. But by helping you eliminate him, we both get what we want. Tell us how you're going to help. Aho suspects Rans is working with someone on the Imperial side. Obviously, I'm eager to keep my role in all this quiet. 
They're holding your Supreme Commander in a secret POW camp. Droid defended security towers ring the perimeter. Any breach will trigger the alarm. I'm transmitting the location of the camp and the codes to disable the tower alarms. Use them as you see fit. This could be a trap, but I think it's worth the risk. <laughs> We can trust Malgus for one reason. He's acting out of self-interest. He hates Darth Arho more than he hates us. Thank <laughs> you.